hey guys welcome back to my channel today i'll be doing this braidless crochet hairstyle so let's jump right into the video my hair is already moisturized and i'm using my white tooth comb to just comb through it quickly before i go into the hairstyle now i'm just taking my scrunchie and i'm just putting it into a high puff here I'm using is the Jamaican Bounce and it's 26 inches and I'm using my Gorilla Snot Gel. You guys know how I love this gel for giving my hair maximum hold and I'm just applying that all around the perimeter of my head. And I know this gel flakes a lot but what I usually do is that I would not um, brush my hair or comb my hair. I would not use a brush or a comb in my hair after this gel has dried because I think that will help to make the flakes appear more in your hair. So if I have to touch up my hair, I would definitely use some moisturizer or some water and dab my hair before I brush it so that it doesn't flake so much. So now I'm taking out the scrunchie and making sure that all the hairs are laying flat and then I'm reinstalling the scrunchie just the same way I do it in all my videos when I'm doing a high bun or a sleek ponytail or anything like that. I always do a double method. Now I'm going in and I'm making a plait in my hair. Now I'm taking my crochet needle and I'm just inserting that into my into the flat portions of my hair and then I'm putting the hair in the crochet needle and then I'm closing the latch and pulling it through like any other crochet method. That's the same way that we would do it for any crochet method. So it's the same thing and I'm only going to be tying the hair once. And I'm only using one pack of hair for this hairstyle and I'll be linking the hair that I'm using in the description box so be sure to check that out. And you want to add the hairs very close to the bun and then when all the space around the bun is completely used up then you can add a few more pieces of hair on the outward portions of the bun. So now I'm just speeding up this part because I'm doing the same process all around the bun and I'm not putting any hair at all on the bun itself. So I'm putting all the hair on the flat portions of my hair and none on the ends of my hair. Now that all the hair is in my head, I'm just going in with my fingers and separating the hair. So I'm just loosening out the curls so that it look more natural. And this hairstyle guys is literally one of the easiest hairstyles that I've ever done. I've always been a fan of crochet braids and crochet hairstyle but this one has just really taken it to the next level where you don't have to corner your hair to achieve the styles. So if you guys want me to do more videos on these type of hairstyles such as crochet hairstyles, um, or braidless crochet please let me know so now I'm going in with my comb and I'm just back combing the hair so that it blends nicely and also help to cover the bun because that is very important that we cover that bun so that it's not sticking out when we're in public and everything like that so you just want to use your white tooth comb and just um, and just back comb the hair it's sort of like a bird nest but still keep as much of the curls as you can possibly keep and then after that, I'm taking a piece of hair from the back portion of my head and I'm just wrapping this all around the entire hair. And this will help to brace the puff so that it stands up on my head instead of leaning to either side. It's 
kind of helping to position it upwards. So you just want to play around with it here and shape it to your liking. I want the puff to have a natural flow so I'm kind of pulling out some of the hairs as well at random places so that I have a few longer strands hanging out and that everything is not necessarily on the same length or on the same um, level. So I'm just playing around with it to my liking. So I'm just trimming some of the longer pieces and some of the hairs that were too fuzzy and I continue to wrap around some more strands of hair to help contour the puff. It is pretty much finished. I really enjoyed doing this hairstyle. It was so quick and so simple and I came up with a bomb hairstyle. And I really hope you guys enjoyed this video and if you did, be sure to support your girl and hit that thumbs up button and also click that subscribe button before you leave. I thank you all so much for watching and I will see you all in my next video.